Hi, this is Clayton, owner of Stony RV in Stony Plain, Alberta. And today we're bringing you this 2018 Forest River Surveyor. This is a travel trailer with quad bunks in the back, front private queen. And the model number is the 295 QBLE. I'm gonna give you a complete video walk around tour of this unit. This trailer has an outside kitchen in the back hard wall construction it's in beautiful shape i got to try to point out any blems as i go but there's not too many it's in really beautiful shape let's start off with the front nose cone here it's a fiberglass nose cone all the uh, clearance lights and side lights are all did uh, led which is one kind of nice it has the docking lights up front with the switch over to the side it has the checker plates in beautiful condition no rock chips whatsoever so it hasn't been down any gravel roads or anything like that it has the front electric jack two propane tanks, brand new battery. We sell all of our trailers with brand new batteries. It has the front and rear stabilizer jacks. It has pass-through storage. That's fully finished on all sides, which is nice. It has a three-step system. Brand new awning cloth, just put on this electric awning. Outside speakers, dark tinted windows, aluminum wheels. There's a black tank flush on this side as well. All your stickers are still on the outside, so it's it's in really beautiful shape. It's white with black, dark blue, light blue, and gray silver. So it's kind of a combination color. The outside kitchen, I don't think this stove has ever been used. Two burner stove, an extra sink, and then a little extra second fridge. Um, you're, you're, they're all magnetic catches, and you can see the four windows but when this lids up for the outside kitchen, it kind of blocks that one window. Spare tire, outside shower, a really nice heavy arched roof for good drainage. Your city water connection, your hot water tank that discharges in the back corner, which is kind of nice. Four bunk windows, a nice big super slide with nice big windows. All the decals are in excellent condition. The side walls are in excellent condition. I'm trying to find any kind of blem Oh, this is a little bit of where it's rubbed. It's probably rubbing from here onto this tin piece here. This is just the tin. There's a little piece there. We can color that with some little black paint. Oh, what else can I tell you in the front here? Yeah, it has a little bit of a compass decal in the front of the surveyor. Let's take you inside. Even the door sticker is still on. Outside light. Assist handle right here. Two steps up. And it really, uh, really opens up with the one slide. So lots of floor space. You have this sofa that comes out into a sofa bed. It has a really big U-shaped dinette. So it can sit one, two, three, four, five, six people tight, four people really comfortably. You can see it has the, the curtains and the pleated blinds, LED lights all along the top, upper cabinets with glass inserts. Your front wall, you can see the arch of the roof in here. The ceiling's height is really tall. You have a, a Bluetooth Jensen stereo. Yeah, it's Bluetooth. Spot for a really nice TV. You could probably fit a 32 inch there, no problem. USB charging ports. You have two hard walls separating the bathroom, which we'll get in, or the bedroom, which I'll show you a little bit earlier. And then uh, you have three drawers. Two sinks, nice and shiny. There's a few cuts on the cutting board, but not too bad. The stove, I don't think it's ever been cooked in. The oven, stainless steel microwave. And then you have the double door Dometic fridge and freezer combo, your thermostat, entrance into the bathroom. You have extra plugs there, a little pantry here, all the books and manuals. Extra plug there. Really nice woodwork trim, some battens on the ceiling. Show you the bathroom real quick. Quick flush toilet. Oh, this is the one thing. We, this is the antifreeze, the pink antifreeze. It's stained the floor. So we're gonna try to get that off, guys. We're gonna try to use a little bleach solution or something, but worst case scenario, maybe a little one of those little rugs in here. But we're gonna we're gonna try something on that, but we'll let you. I'll uh, be right up front with that. The shower is really nice. There's no cracks or anything in the surround. They have the skylight. You have this medicine cabinet here with mirror and sink. 
And then you have your bunk room at the back. There's a curtain that goes across. You have two drawers here, upper cabinets here, and then your bunk, every bunk has a light. They're full length bunks as well. Little storage under here. Some storage under here as well. Another bunk here, another bunk up top. So every, it's a ducted air conditioning, ducted heat. There's a vent in here as well. And last but not least, we got the front bedroom. Sliding pocket doors. Windows on either side. Full size queen bed. You have storage all, around, all along the top on both sides, two drawers on each side, and and uh, some plugs down there to charge on both sides as well. And there's storage under the bed in this front as well. And obviously you can get across here and go in the same way. There's even little cubby holes for storage on both sides as well. So good use of space. There's a spot for a second TV if you want. It has the digital antenna, all your controllers as you walk in. Another plug and all the flooring is in beautiful shape except that little bit of pink. Let's try to, I'm going to try to solve that problem before it gets out the door. So this one also has a brand new awning cloth. The awning had a small rip in it so we're replacing it with a brand new cloth. That's why it's not out in the video but we got it in and we're going to put that in here right away. So let me know if you're interested. My name's Clayton, I'm the owner of Stony RV. You can contact Stony RV directly. 780-968-3333. They can answer all your questions. We offer financing, extended warranties. They've been gone through in our shop completely. The only thing that we don't do is check the, uh, we don't pull the hubs off, but they all have bearing buddies and we watch for tire wear, but we don't check the, we don't pull off the hubs as we are not equipped to do it here. But uh, these newer trailers are usually good and you can just add some grease to the bearing buddies. Nice outside kitchen. You can contact us again, 780-968-3333. You can check out us out on stonyrv.ca. Thanks again for taking the time to watch our video on the Surveyor by Forest River.